what about those stay-at-home stocks, Ryan, getting hammered as the rest of the market rallies yesterday? I'm talking companies like Zoom, Peloton, Netflix, Amazon, all taking a hit over the prospect that life gets back to normal, given the optimism over Pfizer and BioNTech's potential vaccine. And we use fewer of these companies uh, as we won't be staying at home as much. Is this a buying opportunity or do you see this uh, selling continuing? Yeah, I mean, at the end of the day, a Peloton is kind of like a glorified Nordic track, if I had to say so. And Dennis, I don't know if I drop that Peloton on my foot, it might hurt. But I think it's <laughs> 260 years worth of profits baked into companies like Peloton, they've got to be overvalued here. And I've talked about that a lot on your show. And at this point, the problem is you've had so much good news truncated in such a short period of time. And it just look from every angle, the economy is recovering quicker than expected. People are going to want to get out more and more as we manage the vaccine, however that is, you know, whether manage the virus with the vaccine or without a vaccine. So I think at this point, they may get a bounce here, but it's probably not the best place for your money. You know, look at Amazon when it when it during the tech bubble, when it went down, it took seven years to get back to the price that it had at the peak during 2000. So definitely looked at other places where the economy is reopening 100 percent.